Hi, you are welcome on the Continuity Channel. Today I will discuss about the impeller of centrifugal pump, its types and materials, that is of which material it is made. Let's start. At first we will know about the impeller. What is impeller? Impeller is a rotating component of a centrifugal pump which transfers energy from the motor that drives the pump to the liquid being pumped by accelerating the fluid outwards from the center of rotation. Now, types of impeller. Impellers are normally classified into the following types. First, open impeller. Second, semi-open impeller and third, enclosed impeller now. On the basis of suction there are two types of impeller as follows. First, single suction and second double suction. Now I shall discuss about these one by one. At first open impeller. Open impeller rotates between two side plates between the casing walls. In this type of impeller, the clearance between the impeller vanes and side walls allows a certain amount of water recirculation, which increases as wear increases. To restore the original efficiency, both the impeller and the side plates must be replaced. Look at the figure. This is an open impeller. There is no shroud either on one side or both sides of the impeller. That's why it is called open impeller. Now, what are its advantages and disadvantages? Its advantages are as follows. It is capable of handling suspended matter with a minimum of clogging. Disadvantage Structural weakness. If the veins are long, they must be strengthened by ribs or a partial shroud. Its uses. Generally, open impellers are used in small inexpensive pumps or pumps that handle abrasive liquids or suspended solids. Now, second, semi-open impeller. Semi-open impellers have a back wall shroud that adds mechanical strength to the veins. Look at the figure. There is only one shroud on the back side of the impeller. That's why it is called semi-open impeller. Now, enclosed impeller. This type of impeller has both front and back shroud. The impeller veins are sandwiched between the two shrouds. It can be either single inlet or double inlet. That is, enclosed impeller has shrouds on both sides of the impeller. It may be single suction or double suction. That is liquid will be sucked from one side or both sides. Look at the figure. It is enclosed impeller. You are looking well in the right side figure. Single suction and double suction. A single suction impeller allows liquid to enter the center of the blades from only one direction. But... A double suction impeller allows liquid to enter the center of the impeller blades from both sides simultaneously. Now, I shall discuss about the material of the impeller. That is of which material? Impeller is made, the following materials used in the construction of pump impellers. Cast iron, ductile iron, stainless steel, grade 304, 305, 316. Hast alloy, steel casting, aluminum, bronze, brass. Use of material of pump impeller is based on the type of liquid used. For water transfer application typically used impeller material is cast iron, bronze or gun metal to avoid corrosion. For process application such as stainless steel 304, 304L, 316, 405, duplex steel, hast alloy is used. That's all. Now, I stop the session. Thanks for watching. I hope you understand well. If you have any doubt then tell me in comment section. I shall reply. Thank you. Have a nice day.